Russia plans to build underwater tunnel to Crimea after strikes by Ukraine on the Kirsch Strait. After multiple strikes by the armed forces of Ukraine on the Crimean bridge, Russians are seeking alternative access routes to the occupied Crimea. Russian and Chinese businessmen linked to the government are discussing the construction of an underwater tunnel connecting Russia to the peninsula, according to the Washington Post. The agency reported that the negotiations at the end of October were provoked by Russia's growing concern about the security of the illegally constructed bridge across the Kirsch Strait. It is a crucial logistical line for the Russian army, but has been attacked twice by the Ukrainian armed forces and remains a vulnerable target. The negotiations underscore Russia's determination to maintain control over Crimea, which it illegally annexed in 2014, and the increasing dependence of Moscow on China as a source of global support. According to US officials and engineers, implementing such an idea would be challenging. Billions of dollars would need to be spent on construction, which would take years. Moreover, such work has never been carried out in a conflict zone. Despite doubts about the plan's feasibility, experts say Russia has clear reasons to pursue it. Having failed to achieve a decisive victory in the war, Russia faces the risk that Ukraine, noted Alexander Gaboev, an expert on Moscow-Beijing relations. Analysts point out that it is unlikely that the Kirsch Tunnel will be completed in time to assist Russia in its military efforts. Moscow may view it as a long-term investment to ensure secure communications with a territory that could be contested for decades. The project also poses political and financial risks for China, which has never officially recognized Russia's annexation of Crimea and whose companies could fall into a trap of economic sanctions imposed by the US and the EU on the aggressor country.